You guys know I'm a preacher of sunscreen and in today's video we are going to talk about these five sunscreens. So if you are curious about these sunscreen and my thoughts on them then stay tuned. All of the timestamps and the product links will be mentioned in the bottom box video. So let's move on straight with the first sunscreen in the list, which is the Mama Earth's Aqua Glow Hydrating Sunscreen Gel, which has an SPF rating of 50 and PA rating of 4 plus. It costs about 399 rupees for 50 ml. It has this filter called a Suncrack DE, which is a blend of emollient and sunscreen filters like Avobenzone, Octocrylene, Benzophenone 3, Phospholipid, Eutylene Glycol, and Aqua. The ingredient that has been used in a lot of Mama Earth, Aqualogica, and Ayu product and this filter combination is really nice and effective as well apart from that it also has titanium dioxide and zinc oxide which is really great and it also has inclusion of thermal water which is great for sensitive skin hyaluronic acid which is a nice humectant and it uses ifra certified allergen free fragrance which is the second last ingredient of this particular product and the texture itself is really nice lotion like texture no white cast whatsoever if you talk about pilling i have faced zero pilling with the gel to cream based moisturizer the only time i have faced pilling with this is when i used it with a thick moisturizer such as the CeraVe one apart from that it doesn't have any kind of pilling issues comes in this nice cute travel friendly packaging and if you talk about the rating and my overall verdict i would absolutely recommend it and I will give this sunscreen an overall of 4 out of 5. Coming on to the next sunscreen in the list, which is again on the same price bracket. It costs basically the same, 399 rupees for 50 ml. This one is from Conscious Chemist and this is their Berry Bright sunscreen, which is an affordable version of the sun drink and it has an SPF rating of 50, PA rating of 4 plus. It has absolutely the same filters like Evo Benzone, Octocrylene, Phospholipid, Ceramide, Silivanine, basically a similar ingredient list, but it does have an inclusion of fragrance in it, which is the last ingredient in the ingredient list but overall it's a very lightweight non greasy zero white cast kind of a sunscreen absolutely brilliant to layer with other sunscreen as well and i didn't face any kind of pilling does have a semi matte finish but doesn't rise your skin out gives you this nice moisturized feeling it has a texture similar to a body yogurt so it's kind of a, like a sun yogurt and the packaging is really cute comes in this nice lavender tube so yeah it's a great sunscreen and i would give this the same rating as mama earth one 4 out of 5 and I would recommend it to anyone. Coming on to the next sunscreen which is the Fixed Derma Shadow SPF 50 plus cream which has a PA rating of 3 plus S. It is formulated with micronized titanium oxide, avobenzone and sulibenzone. It also has benzophenone 4 which is not a sunscreen ingredient but it is kind of a helper ingredient and it helps other sunscreen filters to perform better. Price wise it's similar. It costs only about 325 rupees for 40 gram of product. It comes in two sizes so you have the liberty of first trying out the smaller one and then you can move ahead with the bigger one so you have a better idea how the product is going to be. It also does have fragrance but if you talk about the texture it is really lightweight. When you first initially applied it if you feel it's thick cream but once you apply it you will have this nice cooling sensation absolutely zero white cast no pilling and you have to blend it a little bit more compared to the conscious chemist or the mama earth one but it will only take about like 30 seconds if you apply the adequate amount and it also comes in this nice cute travel friendly tube packaging which doesn't leaks and it's a pretty decent sunscreen it claims it is water resistant but obviously you need to reapply sunscreen every two hours so yeah that's a great plus point and i would give this again the same rating as the mama earth and cautious chemist about 3.8 to 4 out of 5. coming on the next sunscreen which is highly requested by you guys which is the invisible sunscreen from minimalist this has an spf rating of 40 and pa rating of 3 pluses it has interesting ingredients like tomato fruit extract squalene jojoba oil if you talk about the filters it uses even a plus Avobenzone and octocrylene, which are great filters. It has a fair share of silicones and it also contains squalene, which is really great. Coming on to the texture itself, it looks like a really nice makeup primer, but once you apply it, when I initially applied it, I thought it might dry out my skin. It will give me that dry touch sunscreen effect, but it does have a fair share of glow once you apply it and it has absolutely no pilling, no matter how much you apply it and drag it. I've tried it with a lot of cream to gel based sunscreen and the proof of that is I am swatched every single one of those sunscreen on the back of my hands and none of them pills so far so that's quite a nice thing and that's quite something that it might be believable to you so yeah it's a decent sunscreen comes in this nice 
pump packaging costs something about 699 rupees for 50 gram but if you talk about the packaging the quality the overall sunscreen filters it is a bang for your buck five out of five for this sunscreen and I absolutely recommend it to anyone out there i mean to last but not the least simply be the sun sunscreen the best filters out there it has in total of five filters all of them are new gen filters products are made in korea so yeah obviously korean and japanese sunscreen has the best filters out there it has an spf rating of 50 plus and pa rating of 4 plus it is truly lightweight and it has zero white cast doesn't dulse your skin it doesn't have any kind of filling and it has ingredients like sika which is really calming niacinamide which is really great for your skin and the overall sunscreen is really dewy it gives you this nice TV finish suitable to all skin types and it is obviously sensitive skin friendly because put simply's product are catered to sensitive skin so yeah it's a great sunscreen and i'm truly amazed by the sunscreen the cost is however a little bit higher than all of the sunscreen that i mentioned it comes with the price bracket of 700 to 900 rupees depending upon the sale and you get about 50 ml of product but the overall quality is bang for your buck 100 percent recommended and five out of five for this sunscreen for the filters not a single old gen filter so my God, they have done a brilliant job not only for the packaging the quality the overall filters and i am in love with this sunscreen it also has a nice clean cute packaging so yeah basically these were all of the sunscreen that i recently tried and these were my thoughts on it all of the sunscreen performed really great the thing that i have found in most affordable sunscreen that they are really nice but the only problem is that it does has fragrance it is not a problem but it might be a problem to some of you guys who don't like fragrance i don't mind personally and i absolutely enjoy these affordable sunscreen coming on to these sunscreen which are mid-range i would say mid-range affordable sunscreen they not only justify the price if you pay more you get better texture and better filters so yeah for me it's a great thing both of these sunscreen are certified and if you talk about these three sunscreen i'm not sure about the certification if they do that would be a great thing because i'm in a hunt of affordable sunscreen that are certified and these sunscreen were pretty much great i've had a really nice experience trying this by the way the next part of this video would have the sunscreen stick from minimalist and you guys asked me a lot about the review of this so stay tuned for the next part and let me know your thoughts in the comment box below like this video if you like my content share this video to any of your friends and lastly subscribe to my channel for more sunscreen content and i will see you in the next video so bye bye and take care